Hi, so for the past couple of months, I've been working on an extreme demon where the player icon is completely invisible. And I wanted to make a video just decorating a couple parts. So I hope you enjoy. Right now I've been working on this part right here. I've made like a background and stuff. So I think I'm going to continue on this part. And see how it goes. This is the part so far. Yeah. My idea is to have like kind of a foggy forest look and the whole level kind of has uh, stars all around it so I'm gonna probably make a, a starry background. And I'll see if, like, a lot of smaller stars look good. So let's try just copying a pattern that I can then copy paste, like, all around. So if I just do that, and then lock to, I guess camera X works better. They were a bit too big, so I'm just making them a bit smaller for now. Yeah, I definitely like that better. Now what I can do is just some uh, glow behind the stars, maybe. I think this is pretty good, so I'm just gonna add more uh, of these little mountains to the background, because I feel like this one looks pretty nice. It just adds a bit of variation that I feel like it really needs. The detail I was thinking of adding is like maybe a telescope, just to add like some more details around. Let's see if I can make a simple design real quick. get away with just like making it like this. Now another thing I could add are maybe some uh, houses to make it look like you're near some village or something. Yeah, something like that, but just like a bit a lot darker actually. You can actually use warp tool to make it like yeah just to give it a bit more perspective. I don't really need to add like any more details because they're already like not that visible. These houses turned out pretty good. I don't know what I should add now. Um, well, I guess I can copy this design uh, I've made already on these blocks uh, just to finish it. Yeah, let's do that real quick. So with this, the part feels a bit more complete. Could probably add like another one of these here. Now what I'm thinking of doing is uh, adding some simple saws around the place that just like are there to fill up some space. Uh, Got to go with the classic this design um, and make them like pretty slow. I think that would fit the part the best. Yeah, since I don't really want them to stand out, I'm not going to give them the object color because I gave the object color pretty strong pulses, so I want them to stay kind of blending in with the background. So I guess like this. Actually, it looks better if the, there's like a backside that's brighter and the saw itself being darker, that's pretty cool. I kind of want to try adding like something else. 
I'm not exactly sure, but maybe this will look good? If I try putting it like here... It looks pretty good. Um, then maybe add something in the center then. Maybe there's just this will work. Okay, yeah, that looks good. I just need to put it no glow. Does that look good? Okay, um, I'll try making it just like... Just black, maybe, honestly. Yeah, actually, that works better. I don't really want to add it, like, everywhere. Just, like, have it at a couple parts where it's kind of too empty. And I guess I'll make a smaller version. Yeah, and I, I won't add, like, as many details, because it's just smaller, so that would feel a bit too cluttered. I have like 30 minutes until I have to leave, so I'm gonna leave this part here for now. I'm just gonna start working on this part of it, try to make some uh, designs maybe. So, here, let's see what I can do. I'm gonna try to keep the sort of look I have in this part with these blocks. Just make it like, kind of expand on the idea. Yeah, okay, so... I kind of want these um, very simple like outlines and then I can kind of have like some pattern in here okay, something like that and then just make more variations yeah I can go with like something like this something I've done before that looks really cool I'll just have like glow like this yeah, and then like I have lots of these just like with a lot of variation and it looks pretty like space like I don't know so I can just add these to the other blocks Alright, so I'm gonna leave it at that for now. So I'm pretty happy with the progress I made. I pretty much finished this part, and this part's gonna be looking pretty good, I feel. I still have like quite a long, uh, quite a lot to decorate, but I feel like it's gonna go pretty quickly just because I'm pretty motivated with this. So that's pretty good. So yeah, before I end, let's make a full showcase of this. I'm gonna. <laughs> do it with the icon though because I don't really feel with dealing with every part so yeah, here's what it looks like Alright, uh, the rest is mostly gameplay, but I'll show it anyways.
that last wave is the hardest part of the level. I'll probably make it easier at some point, but yeah, this this part's gonna be hard. Here, let's do this run, and then that'll be the end. Well, that's it. Yeah, I'm actually very happy with the, how this level's turning out as a whole. I think um I'll probably be finished with this like <laughs> by the end by the end of the year or something, because I'm pretty slow at decorating, but for me that's pretty fast. And obviously I wanna verify this myself, so when I'm done with it, I might record uh, my my progress and make a video out of that. I'll see though. I don't think I'll make more videos on this. This was just like a one-time thing because I I wasn't really uh, making much progress uh, with the the other levels I was working on. Next time, I think I'll go back to uh, Fisher Price right here. Um, actually, like started decorating uh, quite a lot on these earlier parts. And I also fin completely finished the the layout. Um, so yeah, I'll probably work on that next. Until then though, thanks for watching. It really means a lot. And I'll see you next time.